Hey David, good Sock to see knives. you. Yeah. yeah, man. We've been working on trying to do something different with multi-tools. So the sync ones, two handles that open up and reveal a pair of pliers. It's been done, we've been doing it, a bunch of other people do it. Yep. Doing a great job of it. So we want to do something completely different. So we work with a design agency called IDEO, and we want to do like a sort of a human factors, how do people use tools, how do people carry them. And what we ended up with is a series called the Baton series. So Baton series. Baton, okay. this is the Baton. This is the Q1 model. Nice, and nice. I love the super name sleek, too. very nice pin shape. You've got a retractable ballpoint pin. This is a pressurized cartridge it comes with. It is replaceable. And you can find a replacement cartridge at whatever office supply nice. store you want to nice. go to. The other thing on the opposite end of the pin, you have a bottle opener, flat blade screwdriver. But we're not done. We're not done. Okay. It has multiple purposes. And you see the two halves here. You got a black and this like graphite colored side. Yep. That pulls apart. You rotate it. You've got spring-loaded scissors. Usually, multi-tool handles are like little, like squeezy one finger. Yeah, things. I mean that's a that's a nice action there. And then to closing it, just kind of go a little past center. It's not a straight line. Line the lines up. Nice. Slides right in. Nice. So this is the Q1. Q1. Aluminum, hard anodized aluminum handle. We'll go to the two now. We have a flashlight. Q2. We have a 75, somewhere between 75 and 100 lumens. We haven't done final testing yet. Okay. It's got a bottle opener as well. And what you've got here, you've got this little red dot on the side here. Nice, okay. Little red dot. So what you do is you're holding it, you take the red dot, you push it, like you're pushing it towards 10 o'clock on a clock face. Gotcha. So just like that, ah. it slides down. That looks like it opened up really it nice is. and smooth. So yeah. you've got a knife blade in there. The handle folds completely flat, so you get a nice grip on it, nice control. Then when you're done, close lock up, lanyard ring, tight, hold on to it. So when you open the knife blade, the lanyard's back here out of the way. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Q2. Q2. Q3. Q3. Oh, I forgot to mention, pocket clip. Pocket clip. Q2 has pocket clip. They all have a pocket clip. And so the nice thing, which I should have an example of, this is basically the size of a marker or a highlighter. Yeah. So. Fit it in like the little office supply section in your backpack, just fit in there, carry it around, super cool. So this one, this one steers a little bit more towards what you would think a traditional multi-tool is. You've got knife blade, file, can opener, bottle opener that all open out. Um, this one also has screwdriver and all. And then one thing I'm gonna talk about, which is really cool on here, um, which we added in. I was at first I was little, I was like, really? It's kind of weird. A chisel, scraper, pry bar kind of thing. That's, that actually could come in handy. It is. Yeah. The, all the components lock into place. You get a little lock release, press that down, rotate the component in. Nice. And then, just like the Q1, got a pair of pliers in here now, instead of scissors. Again, spring loaded. Super cool. Pliers, wire cutter. Three position pliers, yep. Yep. And let's see if I can actually do this. So, you can. One handed open. One handed opening. What is this? Aluminum? Aluminum, yep. That is super solid. So then the last one. Okay. Last but not least. There's, There's the, more. Q4. There's the four. Okay. The four right. comes in this really nice leatherette uh, carrying case. It's got some magnets on it. So it totally unrolls. Totally unrolls. Yep. <laughs> totally. And, um, inside you've got a the Q4 quarter inch hex bits in okay. there. Okay, yeah. So you think, why do you have the hex bits in there? So they're standard bits. You they're can use standard. any bits, but they, but they come comes, with this tool. Comes with an assortment of 12. Good. Um, the, car the carrier for it also has magnets, so if you don't want to carry it in the case, nice. you can keep them together. What I'm going to pull out here, okay. you know, Phillips is standard bit, fits into this part right here, and uh, it's ratcheting? Listen to that. Yeah. Actually, a center-aligned ratcheting screwdriver that's legit and solid yep. and ergonomic. If you have specific ones you need, you can put whatever bits you want on there. It also will carry one bit. It comes with the Phillips straight one, but you can put whatever one you want. It snaps nice. right, snaps in, there. right in, there. in there. Looks like it's a solid snap, too, yep. like you're not going to lose it. Yep. Wow. Spring-loaded. Spring-loaded again. Wow. Well, so we have Q4, Q3, Q2. Oh, I should probably do it this way. There we go. So there's a size difference. So really not that much, just a little no. bit of thickness and a little bit of length. Yep. Sweet. They're all about the size. I mean, here, so here's the one and the four. Wow. Wow. Uh, 39. 
39. Okay. 39, that's, that's great. 49, 69 for the three, and 79 ish for the uh, for the Q4. Chris, man, thanks, thanks for being Dave. with me. Cheers. Cool. If you want to be notified when I post new Ultimate Survival Tips videos, Make sure you're subscribed and click the little bell icon below the video on your computer or mobile app. That way you won't miss out on any new Ultimate Survival Tips videos. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, I've queued up two more to the side that I think you'll like. Plus you can subscribe to this channel below and buzz over to our website for a ton of free resources on survival, bushcraft, bugging out and prepping. And for links to the gear shown in this video, see the video description on YouTube. Okay guys, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.